Hello everybody, um, got a new uh, new present in the mail today. I won an eBay auction and I won this clock radio. This is a early 80's GE clock radio 7-4630. Here's the cool part. It was factory sealed in box. It had the original staples in it from GE. This unit has never been opened, never been plugged in until today. All right, let's take a look at the bottom of it. It is a GE model number 7-4630A. Date code 4232. I assume that's uh, early 80, I assume maybe 1984. But yeah, this unit is brand new in box. Um, that's unheard of. Now let's take a look at the top of it. Wood grain cabinet. Notice no dust, no scratches, no nothing. It just came out of the box today. Now um, there's the buttons. Uh, snooze, sleep fast, slow, wake. Uh, volume control on off. Um, here's the side. We got a tuning knob. We got AM FM. Turn it this way. Um, nothing on this side. On the back, nothing and no battery compartment. So no battery compartment, no dimmer, but a brand new, if you want to call it, 25 plus year old clock radio. Um, let's give it a whirl here. I'll turn the tunes on here. It sounds absolutely magnificent. It doesn't sound like a tin can like most clock radios. This has a nice warm tone to it. I'll turn it off here. Um, it's really 610 and uh, there's no colon between the digits on this one either, like my other GE that I have. Um, sleep timer starts at zero. Don't forget tonight, bar room Scroll it back down to, square, you've been pent up. to zero. Um, the only thing I did notice, even though it's brand new, the alarm button's finicky on it, just like on my other GE that's been through you know, World War II, but it's still... This one still has a fluky alarm button as well. Which is weird because it is brand brand new. Let's set the alarm here. So yeah, now it's working just fine. I guess it's just uh, I don't know if it's a GE thing, but it did the same thing it did before. So we'll set the alarm here for music slash. It says uh, music slash alarm, so we'll set it and go forward here. And uh, what it'll do is for the first nine minutes, it'll play the radio. And then after nine minutes, it'll beep. And when you hit the snooze, radio goes on for another nine minutes. And then the alarm will go back on. So, a little interesting, uh, interesting combination. It doesn't have a dial light. It never did. But yeah, this is, um, how often do you get a brand new antique clock radio? I mean, this is brand new. There's never, this has never been used, never been plugged in, never anything until today. So yeah, this one is going to be taking uh, bedside duties. My other one is going to be relinquished to something else in the house. But again, uh, you can't buy this for $10 at Walmart. Um, this is quality from a bygone era. It sounds beautiful. Uh, it's built like a tank, like most old GE clock radios, which I found out GE doesn't even make clock radios anymore. Even Thompson Consumer Electronics doesn't sell anything under the GE name for clock radios. So this is a relic from a bygone era. It's a great, hopefully this will last me another 30 years. Um, these are the only kind of clock radios I like. New ones seem to annoy me. But yeah, this is... Uh, I've been uh, very happy with my purchase, to say the least. But yeah, this is uh, yeah, you can't find this in uh, you can't find these anymore. They're getting harder to find, and I found one in absolutely flawless condition. I'm very happy with my purchase, to say the least. Um, well, that's about it. Uh, so this is uh, again my new G, my new brand new GE model 7-4630 clock radio that I should. Hopefully I'll be able to pass this on to my kids, even though it's, you know, almost as old, probably as old as I am. So, alrighty, well, uh, that's about it. Enjoy and uh, have a good day.